Welcome! This is Shadow Embers coming in hot, and I'm going to help you with the fundamentals of Rumble Fighter. Let's get into it. Are you ready to get back into the basics? Now that you know how to dodge people's attacks, you need to learn to counter their attacks so you don't always have to worry about dodging, especially when there's no chance of you dodging them. I will be talking about the different types of counters, but how do you perform a counter exactly? Well, to counter, you have to press the kick and guard key at the same time or sometimes the guard key slightly before the kick key. You must perform this key command right before someone's attack would hit you. The only times you are unable to counter someone is if they are grabbing, using an exos special attack, using an unblockable attack, or using a ranged attack whether by exo, scroll, or item. Normal Counters The most basic normal counter you get is just a push forward after catching them off guard. At least that's what it looks like in the game. A lot of scrolls have this basic counter, but it's not that bad because after you counter them, you have a perfect opportunity to attack them whether it's from a combo or just grabbing them and throwing them off the edge. Special Counters There are special scrolls with special counters. Those counters are generally tailored to the scroll itself. For example, Red Storm's counter lifts them up and drops them down, making them roll to the left a little bit which can be great on Moon dropping people off bridges. Another scroll example is Abyss, which when countering, twirls them upwards while hitting them multiple times and knocking them down in whichever direction the Abyss user is facing. There are a lot of different scrolls with special counters. We will talk about each special counter when I work on videos on scrolls specifically. Counter Attacks There are some scrolls that have you press an attack after countering to make the counter do an extra attack. Some scrolls that have these have special counters with it at the start of the counter, like Volador, which flips the attacker over them onto the ground behind them and then has a kick and punch combo after it. The kick makes the user flop onto the attacker's body, launching them up slightly just enough for you to use the punch and makes the user grab the attacker with their legs and twirls them, bringing them back down and a little bit forward, which can fence edge a small fence, such as on Moon. Then there are scrolls that have counter attacks after a basic counter, such as Agni, which after performing the basic counter, you can press the punch key, which will then make them attack as if you were using your Run Z attack on Agni. We will go more in depth of counter attacks when I talk about the scrolls specifically in their own videos. Long Counters There are scrolls that have long counters, which have a longer counter animation and can counter during most of the entire animation. One scroll example is Inner Fire. When the counter is used, the user takes a stance, and during the stance, if someone attacks them within the first half of the stance's animation, the user grabs them and flips the attacker onto the ground in front of them. Another example is Hunter, which the user basically makes a taunt in the counter animation and whenever is attacked during the animation, the attacker hits them twice, but doesn't phase the user and the user then comes back with a solid punch, making them drop down to the ground. Just a forewarning though, with longer counter animations, there's a higher chance on being attacked with an exo, grab, or even unblockable attack, so be wary of spamming the counter. Alternate Counter Animations so these types of counters are similar to long counters, but are built more towards people who know how to counter instantaneously when being attacked, as their active counter frames start sooner than normal counters, but last just as long as the long counters, but have more miss animations, making them more punishable when not done correctly. One scroll that has this is another serpent, which the user laps into their hand and when attacked, at the start of the animation, the user puts the attacker on the ground, hitting them several times before making them fly back a bit. Another scroll that has an alternate counter animation is Kingpin, which the user taunts the attacker, but if attacked at the start of it, the user grabs the attacker, pulls them around to the back of the user, and kicks behind them, making them fly away from the user behind wherever the user was facing. Exo Counters there are exos that will cancel whatever counter your scroll has and use their own special counter such as SL Infiltrator, which grabs the perpetrator, kicks him slightly, throwing him off guard, and smacks him with their gun. Then another good example is Flame Buster, which punches them a bunch of times and then pushes them far away, 
with a burst of fire. Exo attack counters. So there's a select few of Exos that has one of their special attacks as a count. One of the Exos is Phantasm, which makes the user in a Phantasm double which appears behind the attacker both flip backwards as the attacker looks in panic and then gets beat up by both of them before getting stunned and then drops down to the ground. Another Exo is Nightmare Claw, which is rare and you can only get from boxes. When you counter someone with its special move, the attacker gets hit several times and then knocked away from the user by a couple of feet. Both of these Exo attack counters are long counters too, so you have a good bit of time to start the counter early rather than right as the attack would hit you. Just remember, like any long counter, you still are more prone to being grabbed, so be careful. Well, now that you know how to counter and the different types of counters, you should have no issue on countering any attacks that would ever hit you. Well, at least that's what you and I both hope for. Go out and make me proud, my young Rumble Fighters. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you like this video, please hit that thumbs up button on your screen. And if you want to be kept up to date when I release a new video, make sure to subscribe and hit that bell icon so you won't ever fall behind on new tips and tricks about Rumble Fighter. Anyways, this is Shadow Embers, turning out. See you guys later and win that next battle.